Hello everyone, Man Faces here, and today I'm talking about my Ada modifications that I made from the Fallout 4 Automatron DLC. So what I went with is a uh, flying type heavy robot because I wanted something that had high mobility but then I wanted it to have high fire because I'm a medium range fighter so I needed someone who could lay down cover for me and honestly she did a really good job at that. Uh, so basically she has a sentry bot head uh, with the Ahab helmet just because it looks awesome and I felt that was her revenge. We have the Assaultron torso and really I just use it because it has high uh, health but it doesn't have the overheating issue, it's not too large uh, and I just like the look of it. So I'm running with the uh, Voltic frame which boosts energy damage and I have that for the front and the rear panel and on the arm armor. And also it does give uh, a lot of uh, protection. And you only need a rank 2 armor which you should have, so good stuff. I went on ahead and gave it the hacking module just because it was a lot easier for me to do it. So what I found a good setup was is that I have one fast weapon which is my laser, my automatic laser rifle on the right arm and then on the left arm I have a laser gatling. I don't like the unstable weapons because they tend to break a lot. Now the helmet modification isn't unstable, it has a chance of uh, inflaming the target or lighting them on fire and that's actually not that bad because I hardly ever see it break but like the arms, you just want sturdy arms. Now I have tried with another bot that had back modifications and uh, the unstable fat man's fine and then if it breaks it just breaks. So I have sentry bot arms for both my arms and then I have the high voltic frame. I could go with the sentry bot chest uh, but I like the fact that Ada doesn't get stuck anywhere. She kind of moves where she needs to be. For her legs she has the Mr. Handy thruster with the voltic frame. Um, it's pretty high end so I'm not too sure you'll be able to start the DLC with this setup but just know that the voltic pieces they help a lot. They help a lot more than the power armor uh, Tesla pieces although it doesn't say it like if I try to remove any of her voltic pieces you notice that the damage is still 73 so it doesn't calculate it but I'd imagine it would do about the same thing only we can stack it a, a bunch more times namely five times which is pretty good so anyways I just wanted to uh, share my Ada modifications with everyone because you know, I seen a couple of peoples and they were showing it off and I thought that was really cool and you know, I want to see you guys and so you can shoot me a picture, you can shoot me a video, you know, whatever because honestly I'm trying to play with the DLC for as long as possible, at least until the next one comes out. So anyways, thanks for watching, take care everyone.